Frick on a stick. Ah. Oh. No. <laughs> yes. Fuck yeah! We didn't get any eggplants though, we just got hearts. We want I am the king of hot cums. I want to I leave the, the cross queen of my old <laughs> farts. Let it go, let it go. Cold creeps coming. I poop on a wind and sky. I was still a little <laughs> bit in shock that Amanda was able to hide this so well from me. She's always been such a force of positivity in my life. Especially after we lost her father. That perfect girl is gone! <laughs> I just like to imagine her singing the fucking like singing "Let It Go" while she got a trebuchet made of ice, just whipping her turds into the fucking town. <laughs> let it go, let it go. <laughs> it must be done. Olaf's like nose gets fucking knocked off, and it's just a big fucking nasty dookie hanging out of his pants. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure she would appreciate it right now. Maybe I could talk to her about what's going on. <laughs> I just want Elsa to shit on that town. <laughs> That's all I want. You have fun gossiping about me? Mr. Mega and I actually just gossip about our celebrity crushes. <laughs> Okay, uh, Mario Batali the whole time. <laughs> it was very it was a very productive meeting. <laughs> and I'll, s I'll stay hydrated <laughs> if you want, nor <laughs> remember to stay hydrated. Sure thing. Fuck. <laughs> we can make something at home. Let's go to the mall food court. Let's make something at home. Or. I think the mall food court's the most social thing. Yeah, and like we're this is the more special dads. Hmm. <laughs> Can't a dad take his daughter to the mall? Will you buy me things? I will buy you a thing, singular. <laughs> it's like a deal to me, and it's gonna be like. Crazy ass shit like diamond encrusted horse big, dildo. Big Yoshi. <laughs> I'm sorry, Nintendo. Do you have the big Yoshi? The big Yoshi. <laughs> I love how they called Nintendo and they knew it was they knew it was Donkey. They knew it was him. <laughs> or was when, that? Or was that GameStop? I when know. I was a kid, I loved Super Mario World so much that. When my parents got me this for a birthday party of mine, like these little party blower things, and I was like, I can finally pretend to be Yoshi with the dude, tongue. Dude, that's what I fucking would have thought, dude. That's like, that's the best thing. And that's I was just like, boom, boom. Keep my Guess up. what? You have the green tongue. Yeah. Which doesn't mean shit. <laughs> I have the blue one, so anything I suck up, I can fly. Oh shit. Well, I green one is like cool because like that's like the color of you grass. Can, you can spit out <laughs> shells. I can. I can. It's the color of weed, dude. Because this red one here. You suck something up, you'll always blow fire. Every time I suck, I always Yellow blow. one will always make you stomp. <laughs> stomp the yard. Stomp, stomp. Fuck, I'm fucking idiot. Anything I suck up. So if you suck dad sack, you'll fly. Yes. You know, you know. sometimes when a kid gets older, you, they, uh, they find that they have to keep things hidden from their parents. And that's okay, because sometimes that's what kids do. And that's okay. But also sometimes it's good to have a parent's perspective, because, you know... Maybe the parents uh, have also dealt with similar situations. Mm. And maybe they're a little cooler than you give them credit for. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is that it's good to share. Love ya. <laughs> you my tweet? He like drops, I'm like, fuck! 
Oh, uh, no. You have a Twitter? What? Never mind. I want Yellow Yoshi to stomp on my balls. <laughs> <laughs> I, I need I need him to put on fucking uh, like like long stiletto heels and stab me in the ass and just and like suck up the shell and just boom and God leave a cl dust cloud on my testes fuck uh, we dust Mr. cloud Vegas said you've been participating in, you haven't been participating in class and that you're not turning things in huh. oh, I'm fine pop senioritis and all that well, like sequelitis if you know what I mean. I thought you liked Mr. Bagel's class. Uh, it's fine. He's fine. It's fine. He's fine. We'll do a stop like that. I have my hand up with my gout run still eyes. still texting. <laughs> just, just, I want you to know that you can talk to me any about anything. Uh -huh. I can tell that whatever it is, she doesn't want me knowing about it. That's frustrating. Yellow Yoshi Ball Stomp is an underserved <laughs> porn market. I want that to have the quote I, I Elon Musk was... right under it. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff Bezos. Yeah, Jeff Bezos. <laughs> Yellow Yoshi Ball Stomping is an underserved porn market. <laughs> I kind of, like, if I had a podcast, like the Best Friends podcast... That's a title of it. Just... That would, yeah, that'd be fucking good. That's, that would be a good podcast. Their, your colostomy bag is a Z like targetable weakness. Was so fucking good. Start filling it now. <laughs> Emma R is going to that fancy art school in California. That's exciting. Fill me. Start filling yep. it. Fill me. Either one. Start. <laughs> Are you bummed that you guys aren't uh, aren't going to the same school? Firming, flaming, flaming. Oh, I see. Okay, I was like, <laughs> he's texting. She stifles a laugh. What's so funny? Uh, it's a. Uh, I don't think you get it. Okay. Is it about food? Who are you text? texting? This is so awkward. Who's Noah? My friend. Does he go to your school? Hmm. Yep. Do you like Noah? Ah. What? No. Dad. <laughs> Ugh. I can't believe you would. <sighs> Dad. I mean, jeez. <laughs> Why would you... Ugh. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> sorry, I sorry. Said, just just asking. asking. Dad, he's just my friend. And then you just hear Noah's like, like on voice, and he's just like, "What? I'm, <laughs> no! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I want to go on record, Amanda's father. I am heavily involved in her life, and I have a. <laughs> and she's saying I'm just a friend. That fucking cuts deep. Bye. Click. <laughs> Social link down one hundred percent. Guys and girls can just can be friends. He's my friend. Hmm? Okay, okay. Jeez. This is going well. <laughs> well, good talk. Love you, kiddo. She leans forward and turns up the radio. I guess that conversation is over. This is 93X. No, oh, no, I'll take you on. Head strong, I'll take on anyone. Head strong, head strong. Where this you belong. Where we belong. <laughs> what, was, what was another fucking EMV song? Fucking, and it's like, This animal, animal I have become. Do you, you believe, believe this is the real me? me? I love to help me tame this animal. Burning pies. You can save bookmark. Ah, oh, shit, I didn't read that. That's... We arrive at the mall, a big indoor shopping center with a couple different floors. It's kind of dead, but that doesn't stop mall security from yelling at a group of loitering teens. Let's eat something disgusting for dinner. Hell yeah! Language, Missy. Huh? Heck yeah? Better! Mm. <laughs> HFI, hell yeah? 
There's greasy restaurant after a greasy restaurant. My heart burns just looking at the menus. Nobody looks happy to be here. <laughs> Spoon Pan A and B. <laughs> Did, what, what are you in the mood for? Bread dipped in sugar? Bread with cheese on it? Or are you just want me to inject some fat directly into your bloodstream? Jesus Christ. I want some insulin? <laughs> <laughs> I got some insulin for you, buddy. I extend my hand to her. <laughs> Spoon Man A and B. <laughs> yep. <laughs> With you, do we? I don't shake the dasha. Shake the hand of the grin. I would make the happiest, cheesiest girl alive. Come together with your hands, Spoon Man. <laughs> That would be pretty good for Naruto when they do hand seals. Just a bunch of footage of them doing hand seals, the Spoon Man. <laughs> but also strangely delicious, she said they were bad. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And we have to eat through the pain. <laughs> we enjoy the fluorescent cheesy goodness together until we're all out of nachos. So! Hmm. Something's been bothering me for a while. Can you explain... Mm -hmm. No! No, Dad! <laughs> no! It's like my dad with F. Yeah! You know how flawlessly he uses it. Yeah, he uses it perfectly. Like, to press F to pay respects. <laughs> my dad is a fucking king of that one. It's really good. <laughs> <laughs> explain all memes. <laughs> please explain to me the yeah, jar meme. The jar and the ass meme, please explain that to me. <laughs> no! Explain Goatsy to me, please. Explain Tub Girl to me, please. Explain Blue Waffle. Explain. <laughs> memes are inside jokes shared by a bunch of people that get less funny the more people do it. So the problem is that by the time a meme gets to you, Dad, all of us youths have already done the joke to death. Yep, it's it's uh it's it's communication viruses basically. <laughs> like that's actually what they are. Grin man is cockmongler, and I know that. And for some reason, I take pride in that fact. I shouldn't. <laughs> I absolutely should not. <laughs> But I know what you're talking about, Norm. <laughs> and what's worse than that is that the TV and video games will try to jump in on a meme train. That's just based on how long it takes to make them. The meme will not be... I'm sorry, the meme will be long dead by the time it comes out, and that just dates it and it isn't funny. Oh shit, what up? <laughs> Damn! Damn! Ugh. Dad, please. <laughs> Oldest meme I can think of is probably I can ask cheeseburger, cheeseburger or like uh, fucking that dancing baby. The uh, Fresh Prince was pretty. Was about when I got into it. Yeah, like like oldest one I can think of is like fucking. Uh, there was a show called Ally McBeal who had like a digital 3D image of a baby dancing, and that was a meme on the internet for a while. And that's only the oldest one I can think of. Oh, really? Is already old. Yep. Yep. Wanna go to that goth store? Mm. I could tell by what? the way you dress that you're definitely gothic. And you shop at Hot Topic. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know the words to that song, but I, I think it was something like that. Following up with the party bar is what got me, I think. Yeah. Just hot shop at Hot Topic. <laughs> you know, the one that's all black and tries to establish itself as anti-establishers despite being the exact representation of the establishment? Jeez. I don't know what story you're talking about. You know, the one where you could buy chain wallets and it's basically an assault on what people fought so hard against in the punk and the hardcore movements of the 70s and 80s. Hmm. <laughs> Dude, you gotta be more specific. That's every store, you fucking idiot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The one you threw up in uh, that one time. Oh, that one! <laughs> you threw up in a hot topic. What is happening? You just walk in there and you're just like... Ah, uh, Dave Mustaine. <laughs> 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 
Do you still see the outline of where she barfed? That sucks. I'm so proud. That's such a Speech. gross. Speech. They haven't changed the carpet. Speech, 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 speech. All right, I'll do it if you stop, stop chanting. chanting. Stop. stops immediately. I clear my throat. <clears throat> Thank you all for joining us here today. I commemorate an historic moment that would forever shape history. On a day very much like today, some five years ago, our very own Amanda and oh bitch had too much blue raspberry slushy and on an outing to the mall. After begging her father to take her to dead, goth, and beyond to buy rainbow suspenders, she proceeded to throw up all over the display of My Chemical Romance merchandise. Her loving father then had to pay for said merchandise, which to this day remains among our possessions. Thank you. Okay. And as she begins clapping, slow at first, and then faster, and more vis vigorously. Several other pages turn their heads. One of them also starts clapping. I bow my head. Hey. Oh, hey, chain wallets. Amanda busies herself looking at band t-shirts. I try to find something of interest to put myself. Not much for a dad to look at in Dead Goth and Beyond. Peruse the band t-shirts. Look at ironic mugs. Check the clearance bin for hot deals. Let's look at clearance. Big part, cardboard ox. Cardboard ox. Oof. Of markdown items. I'm pretty sure four dollars is for purple eyeliner is a good deal, I think. I wonder if I would look good in purple eyeliner. I've got blue lipstick, so why not? Mugs, man. I got a fucking I went to Hot Topic and had like a conversation about the ironic mugs with the guy working behind the counter, and then eventually like talked myself into buying an all real monsters mug that looks like a trash can. Yeah. It is the <laughs> ugliest. It's awful. It Wanna is see ironically bad mugs? I'll be right oh, back. Shit, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking did it. I shouldn't have done it, but I did. In fact, I'm just gonna Grab all of my stupid ass ironic bullshit <laughs> and just have a little show and tell on stream real quick. So you gotta bring in the count like tit mug. Oh, yeah. No, that's that's coming in. <laughs> uh, this there's probably more, probably even in this room, but I can't think of it at the moment. Oh wait, yeah, there was the. Uh... Okay, got this. <laughs> I've shown Look, this, this is... on stream before. <laughs> oh shit! What up? <laughs> Oh god, that! Yeah. But, let's just do it again real quick. Let's, I'm gonna switch over for just a moment here. I'm gonna borrow that there. Yes. I'm just gonna... Uh, you can... Do, you can... Uh, okay. Just look at us for a sec. I have certified hempergized Cana Energy hemp supplement that I'm never gonna drink because it's going to kill me. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a hemp-based energy drink or something, right? <laughs> yep. And it has Ben used hemp, and it has a picture of Benjamin Franklin. <laughs> like, drink hemp. It's cool. It's it's fine. <laughs> Um, <laughs> fucking certified hempergized is the <laughs> best thing I've ever like, seen. This right movie. here is my uh, cow mug with four teats of stands. Yep. And you just, it's just... Oh, it's blueberry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so now I can print on stream. Oh, no, that, that's my account. You can friend me if you want. Yeah, I can <laughs> I can friend you if you want to on Steam. I don't do much on Steam, so you're probably just gonna like see yeah, me make most, you most of the basement quality stuff is, but I use mo mostly just use my stuff. Um, uh, my don't worry, be Yonce, uh, <laughs> fucking sweatshirt. <laughs> yeah, yes, I I own that. And last but not least. I weed kush. Oh, 
I it's kind of <laughs> like a heart, but it's a red weed leaf. It looks you could like from a distance. The police might think it's actually a maple leaf, and you're Canadian. Yeah. And the Kush. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Cops can't read the code. <laughs> That's utterly terrible. Shame on you, dirty Andy. <laughs> And yes, I did buy these with money. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get back to Dream Daddy. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, everything's over here now. <laughs> I overhear a stifled argument over the over at the cash register. An older gentleman is carrying a garment and showing it to uh, a bored looking cashier with pink hair. I can see that. Don't <laughs> don't uh, don't know what to tell you, dude. I just work here. <laughs> oh, it's the cashier. Please. <laughs> when I bought this online, the website said this blouse was Victorian inspired. However, when I received it, it clearly held the trademarks of Edwardian dis dressage. <laughs> do you do you want a coupon? I can give you a coupon. Will you leave if I give you a coupon? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a manager <laughs> president? <laughs> president? People have to know what they're buying. I am the manager. I see. Well, it would seem that I have outstayed my welcome. Good day, shopkeep. Your superiors will receive a strongly worded letter by post. <laughs> into bats. <laughs> it just blows Whatever, up into bats. Dude. The man whirls around and storms out, his literal coattails trailing behind him. I can tell if they are Victorian inspired. I can't tell if they're Victorian inspired or Edwardian in nature. Linda trots up to me with a t-shirt in her hand. Oh boy, here it comes. Yeah, there are way better places to buy that shit besides Hot Topic. Oh really god, weird. yeah. Oh. Hey, Dadtron 5000. Yes, I'll buy it for you. Wow, that was easy. Thanks. At least it's only one this time. Pops the shirt on the counter and grins to the cashier. And that shirt's gonna be like forty bucks or something. Yeah, they're usually like like twenty bucks. Uh, and then like the the sweaters are expensive. Like I got this fucking sweater from Hot Topic, but one of my friends had a bunch of hot cash they let me use for my birthday. So I got a fucking just. Yeah. So I got it way cheaper. It was like thirty bucks instead of being sixty bucks. Nice. Do you know how much this weed hat is? Five dollars. Ten dollars. Damn it. <laughs> I got taken for a ride. Yeah, yeah, they could have. You could have just gotten them Renfest. That is a better place to buy the shit he wants to wear. Yeah, for sure. So what was that guy's deal? As she rolls her eyes so hard, I'm worried she'll pull something. That's Damien. He's in here all the time. He's obsessed with Victorian fashion or whatever. Why is he going on a hot topic? Though that is super stupid. But he's going for that. Yeah. It's more punk stuff and like weird like. Uh... She hands Amanda her... Unless there's a specific show. I don't know. Hands her bag and it's clear the conversation's over. Like the Brent Fest in Wisconsin's really good? Oh, really? Okay. I've never been, been to that one. I I try to go to, to this... To the one in Minnesota every year because I love it. And then I sit on the couch trying to find something to watch over bowls of ice cream. Oh, cool. Long Hard Paranormal Ice Goat Roast Truckers is on your favorite, right? Oh, it's it's way, it's a bigger than ours? Like, like how big is it? Like, they have more than one elephant? <laughs> <laughs> oh, ten times bigger? Damn. Jesus. Oh, oh hell yes! I, they have to make, make it over the Canadian tundra before the ice road melts, but they're all... <laughs> <laughs> they're, uh, but also they're hunting ghosts <laughs> and the trucks are haunted <laughs> it's like one of our promos or something <laughs> yeah 
This isn't ran in the clan. <laughs> what? <laughs> the, co the coast done got control of the truck. I can't steer <laughs> steer on them yet. They're damn ice roads. Let me use this EVP meter to try to communicate with the birds. Oh shit! It's Flint, pretty far. We're away. about to die. I uh, almost got it. If you if you listen carefully, it sounded like it's saying, "You're going to die." <laughs> That's because we're about to die. You. Yeah. <laughs> this is art. <laughs> <laughs> The episode ends and Amanda excuses oh. herself to go and start arg uh, arguments on the internet. I stay up a little longer, curious about the exploits of Callum and Flint Dogbone <laughs> after their disastrous ice road accident. Afterwards, I crawl into bed and get a good night's sleep. <laughs> Exercise regularly and you'll stay healthy. Okay, cool. Morning, sleepyhead. Five, five more minutes. minutes. I didn't choose five more minutes this time. If you ever let me have five more minutes, so get up. Fine. Have cereal for breakfast and spend the. <laughs> Remember Kaizo Mario <laughs> Super Mario Bros. Uh, cereal? Oh yeah, Kaizo Mario <laughs> cereal. <laughs> <laughs> fucking just like broken glass in the box. <laughs> This is this is this is for the this is the real strong players of cereal, because <laughs> like, there's a Super Mario Brothers cereal, um, and it's also the, the box is an amiibo. You can use it to get a heart in uh, um, fucking Mario Odyssey, and I just like painted over it so it said Kaizo Mario Brothers cereal. And you put a bunch of chain chomps yeah, in there. And all shit. the chain chomps all over the fucking place. <laughs> We have cereal for breakfast and spend the morning putting together furniture. Amanda is much better at interpreting the tiny manuals. We're able to put together a few shelves and one desk, and I'm pretty sure it was supposed to be a bookcase. Oops, ball bearing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so excited for the cookout today. So I had to beef up my grilling skills. If there's food, I'm excited. I'm all over those terrible store-bought sugar cookies that everyone brings to parties. <laughs> Come on, Aaron, shut up. Everybody likes those fucking cookies. You suck. Mm. <laughs> I know that's him who wrote that, because he has... Yeah, those are bad. Amanda concurs. No. Which means I just want to know, in the chat, me. is anybody out there not like those, those sugar cookies? Because I fucking love those. Mm. I'm just curious if I just have... I'm the one who's outlier here. <laughs> Probably end up standing comfortably in the corner with a plate of food and hope that nobody talks to me. Oh, really? Okay. All right. Well, yeah, they're not as good as like homemade cookies, but I enjoy them. <laughs> Your beautiful work in progress. Okay. Most okay. people are in support. But one very strongly worded opinion in the other. Well, but I, I think I know who Aura is, and I know like uh, like they they do make better oh. better food. So oh, I, yeah, I believe I mean, that. But it, usually anything homemade will be better than yeah, because they're like preserved well. as hell, so they stay on the counter. But yeah, I like them. I also Girl Scout cookies. Give me a pack and a gallon of milk, and I might make a meal. Yeah, yeah. I, I've made that mistake before. Just like sit down and just like I'll have some cookies, and it's all the cookies. We better, we better start getting ready. We definitely don't want to be late. What? No, we have to be fashionably late. Who shows up to a cookout on time? You know what? We're going early, just because you said that. Head out the door, Amanda reluctantly files. You don't have to leave Aura because I. <laughs> you don't have to leave. No one has to ever leave. Please, for God's sakes, don't leave. Yeah. <laughs> well, just change the name of the stream. Just watch watches a man has emotional breakdown over just, his chat. Leave. Wow, it. incredible! Man has emotional breakdown over. Over loss of friend in video game. In <laughs> video game. <laughs> video game. 